I'm out here uh, uh, training dogs today uh, with birds and uh, we're going to try and show you how we do this because the hardest part or where people seem to get lost they get a bird dog and you know they um, don't know where to get birds or how to plant them or how you do it the right way and there's no quick and easy way of doing it um, t I'm just going to start this. We're going to do more videos in the future that really show you different birds, pigeons, using quail, using launchers, using pigeon socks, um, the way we uh, check cord them in and the things we do. A good hold for quail is like this. That's a bird man's hold. You get him by his back legs like that. See, he can't go. I got him. Put him in my bird bag. Just keep in mind that these dogs have been through their yard training. First you do yard training before you even mess with birds. Birds come after your dog listens to you, heals, sits, woes. Um, then you do it. But today I have a special dog that's getting pretty old. This is uh, I'm Lucky 2. We call him Deuce. Um, the guy here that owns this property, Bob Montler, um, named him Deuce. Um, he's blind. Uh, he's my main man uh, and I feel bad he went blind this year. But I'm going to show you something. A blind dog pointing birds. His nose works fine. He's in here chomping at the bit, and he's happy as he can be. I want, here, I want you to meet Deuce. Deucey boy, what's up? How you looking, buddy? You ready to get the birds? Huh? You ready to get the birds? Come on. This is Deuce. This is my main man, Deuce. Yeah, you ready to go get him? Deuce doesn't need a collar or anything like that. Uh, it's This is nice soft fields that he can't run into anything. I'm going to set him down. And then I'm going to try and head him. Head him to his birds. I'm going to point him in the right direction. Come on. There he goes. I'm going to grab the gun. Here, boy. Good boy. Good boy. With the retrieve and everything. Let me show you my boy on the thing. 